The process of photosynthesis begins when the sun hits the leaves of the plant with photons of light energy. In the light reaction, light energizes the pigment of the photosystem located in the thylakoid membrane. Next, in photosystem 2, electrons are excited by photons and an electron of P680 is excited and accepted by the primary electron acceptor. Next, electrons from a split water molecule are used to fill this deficit of electrons. Then, the accepted electrons from the electron acceptor flow down an electron transport chain, transferring protons across the thylakoid membrane. This creates a concentration gradient. This concentration drives protons down the channel protein ATP synthase, producing ATP from ADP and inorganic phosphate. Then, P700 elevates its electrons and accepts an electron flowing down the electron transport chain. Last, this electron elevated from P700 flows down another electron transport chain and is donated to NADP+, creating NADPH. CO2 is incorporated to RUDP by Rubisco, creating two three carbon compounds. The three carbon compounds are phosphorylated by ATP and ADPH donates electrons to G3P. Six G3Ps are created and one is released to become a sugar. Five G3Ps are rearranged to three RUDP, setting up another rotation. The products of the light reactions of photosynthesis are used to fuel the Calvin cycle. The first one of these is NADPH, produced by the reduction of NADP plus with an electron. The second one is ATP, which is produced when ADP is phosphorylated to ATP by ATP synthase. Carbon dioxide is absorbed through the outside environment to be used in the Calvin cycle.